I put here uh, uh, two tablespoon of coconut oil. Uh, it's getting heated. I have here uh, two onions uh, diced into uh, pieces. Here I have three brinjols. Here one cup of uh, uh, Thur dal with the three green chilies soaked for uh, 15 minutes, a half a tomato. Here I have uh, diced red chili of tree and with a um, little bit of asa fortida. Here I have uh, red chili and uh, uh, turmeric mix. Maybe I will add a half a teaspoon of uh, um, uh, coriander powder. Sorry. And here I'm going to add two teaspoon of uh, uh, mustard seeds and uh, quarter teaspoon of meiti seeds and uh, quarter teaspoon of jeera and uh, quarter teaspoon of wood oil. And I'm going to put this uh, red chili into it. So let it get roasted then I will add the onions to it. Hi friends it's Margaret Wood from Maggie's Kitchen going to prepare a instant brinjal dal curry. Uh, today is a very um, boring day for me I was not doing that much well so I'm going to make everything instant today so that uh, I have uh, food for myself and for my family. Uh, so today I am preparing uh, uh, brinjal curry with dal. Uh, so it will be very tasty mixed vegetable with dal. I added the onions. Um, the ingredients I added for roasting. It's got roasted so it smells very good. I am adding onion as well as the brinjal together. So let it roast for uh, 5 minutes. I added everything here, uh, the dolls, uh, salt, brinjal uh, and everything uh, comes out well. I will cook this for 15 minutes in the instant pot. So we will get uh, mixed uh, doll with uh, uh, brinjal within 15 minutes. See uh, the brinjal uh, with the um, um, doll, it become a very good uh, a uh, kutu type or curry type it tastes very good uh, uh, it's margaret wood signing off from maggie's kitchen thanks for watching and home cooking is made easier healthier and tastier bye for now